happy pride month and welcome to or welcome back to my channel this is fierce enough and i'm making these pride lashes you know i'm not good with the colors of the rainbow so i had to enlist my little sister and be like so which order does it go i'm the worst but we figured it out and we have this little creation here so i'll show you exactly how i made it the materials etc you can always ask questions below or dm me on instagram Keep watching so there's a few lashes i'm going to be using uh, the hair vault is one of them ashes to lashes and tab make trap so the first lash i'm going to take off is the hair vault 0.07 d and 12 millimeter put that down and then after that i'm going to put the 14 millimeter 16 millimeter and 17. then i'm going to take tab make trap in the orange 14 16 18 from ashes to lashes 14, 15, 10, because I did not have 18 or 16. This one is the hair vault in green, 14, 16, 18. Then we're gonna use the hair vault again, blue, 16, 17, 18, the hair vault once more, and a 12 millimeter, which I didn't end up using, and then 15 millimeter and 16. I'm using the magnetic bond in place of the glue aid to see how it works. It is from Lash God. So grab your first lash. You're gonna be putting down a 12 millimeter and you're actually gonna put it down four times before putting down a 14 millimeter. And the fans are medium wide, I would say. Not too wide, not too narrow. That's what it looks like. So do that on both sides. And this video is gonna be very quick. I'm really just showing you how to do it with the red really quickly and then skipping through the rest because it's self-explanatory. So after you do that, you're gonna get your spike. Here it is. Your spike is a narrow fan that is not um, fanned out at all. It just pick it up, close it, put it on there, put it right next to it. So it's a 16 spike. After that 16 spike, it's two 17 spikes and a 16 spike to close it off. And then you want to add on two more of the red and 14 millimeters. And that's essentially how we're doing this entire, entire set. When we get to the yellow, what you're going to be doing, since I only have um, a 14, a 15, and a 10, with Ashes to Lashes, that brand, they, they, the longest they have is 15. So I needed to make it a little bit longer in the middle since I'm using 17s everywhere else. So what I did was I put down the 15 and then I put a 10 on top of that, like halfway on top of that to make it look longer. Basically extending it and making it a little bit longer. And if you need an example of that, of how I do that, I do that a lot on the Shea Shea Lash video. So... You can definitely see it on there but if it's confusing to you at all leave a comment or dm me you guys have been so great with dming me photos of what you've been doing just let me know and i can help you out because that's what i'm here for this is what we have so far the orange is down pack and we've got the spikes going on this on one side starting to come together here's the yellow We've got the medium wide fans. And then I'm gonna add the spike. So I add the 15. On top of the 15, midway, right there, I'm showing you I'm putting the 10 millimeter lash on top of that. So extending it. Right after we're done with our set, we seal the deal. You already know, and I'm doing it this way because I attached them at the bottom, so I want to seal the deal at the attachment point. Here, I'm showing you how you should take off your lash strips. If you purchase lash strips from my Etsy, um, it should be Etsy, Fierce Enough, Shop, or Closet, something like that. Or if you make lashes yourself at home, just go ahead and take them off from the base. Please do not take them off 
from the actual lash strip or you'll be pulling them and you will miss lashes and they'll be bald and that's not fun. Do me a big favor and subscribe. Comment below if you have any questions or DM me on Instagram at fearsomef. Happy Pride Month. I know Pride Month is over, but as always, happy Pride Month. Black Lives Matter. Black Trans Lives Matter. Highlight your titties and wear your SPF.